We spent more than 80 hours testing 11 of the best slow cookers you can buy. This is the crock pot, and here's why it's our best overall pick. The crock pot six quarts provide you with enough room to slow cook meals for large dinner groups. It weighs 11.9 pounds empty, which puts it right in the middle of the pack. The cord measures 25.25 inches, giving you plenty of reach in any kitchen. The lid has locking clamps and a rubber seal running around the inside to prevent moisture from escaping, which means it'll cook your food more efficiently and not dry it out. The locking clamps also make it a great option for tailgating or other activities that require transport. Unfortunately, this unit did not come with any accessories like temperature probes or meat racks, but there are 10 recipes in the accompanying instruction manual. To test the slow cookers, we settled on a beef stew recipe. We not only looked for internal and external temperatures for each cooker, but measured the amount of fluid lost during cooking, and of course, considered the tenderness and taste of the meat and veggies. This crock pot performed very well in our testing, leaving the meat firm yet tender with plenty of flavor in the accompanying vegetables. Our taste testers did note that compared to other slow cooker batches, this broth was a little lacking with an oily consistency that was less flavor fusion from the beef and veggies. Whether this was due to our specific cuts of meat or the actual performance of the slow cooker is unclear. In our evaporation test, this one only lost 6% of water when running on high for four hours and 5% when running on low for four hours. These results outshine the other units we tested, leading us to conclude that with the crock pot, your food is less likely to dry out during cooking. When on the high setting for four hours, we measured the internal and external temperature of the device. Liquids reached 195 degrees Fahrenheit, which is great because the warmer the fluid on the inside, the faster your food will be done. And although speed isn't necessarily the name of the game when we're talking about slow cookers, a little bit of time saved here and there is a nice touch. On the outside, we measured temps just above the digital display, as well as the size of the unit, just below the handles. Above the timer, it measured 100 degrees, while the sides measured 95 degrees. This was much cooler than any other device in our comparison, which means this device's surface is much less likely to burn you. You can set the timer anywhere from 30 minutes to 20 hours in 30 minute increments. Now, there is no beeping to indicate that the food has reached your set time, so you will need to keep an eye on the digital display to know when the food will be done, or set an alarm on your phone or oven if you need an audible alert. Uh, one feature we really liked was that this device automatically switched the warm setting once the timer had ended. By comparison, most manually set slow cookers don't offer an automatic warm feature. Instead, they require you to turn the warm setting yourself. When you are done cooking, you can place both the stoneware and the lid in the dishwasher instead of taking more time to hand wash them. This crock pot is a perfect choice for serving large parties and its locking lid and rubber seal makes it even better if you have to take your food to go. The digital interface with its countdown cooking timer and automatic switch to the warm setting is also a nice feature. And that's why it's our best overall pick in slow cookers.